Well, let's take a look at the Knights student section. Let's glow St. Joe's. Second quarter, Knights up a dominating 28-7. Knights on the drive. Dylan Chris finds his receiver downfield for the Pirates 30 at the Pirates 30 for a first down and more. Eric Camarena gets the handoff. He fumbles it, but the ball goes out of bounds before the Pirates can recover. Chris looking to pass. He rolls right and he finds Jesse Cuevas, the freshman tight end, 4-6. Knights lead 35-7. Pirates are looking to get back within reach. Jude Pritchard finds junior wide receiver Nikki Casey for the first down. Knights with the ball. Jose Corona. Jose Corona now in a QB. He fakes the handoff and he keeps it and he squeezes his way into the end zone. 4-6, 42-7. Knights lead. By senior running back Carter Vargas. They're led by Carter Vargas, who had four of the six touchdowns. Pritchard out of the shotgun finds Dalton Beard making dangerous moves to get the first down, but the Knights proved to be too much to handle for the Pirates. St. Joseph proves why they're the reigning five time Mountain League champs, dominating effort on both sides of the ball. St. Joseph hosts Paso Robles next Friday at 7. Sandy Inez hopes to bounce back next week, hosting Napomo.